everybody it's me again welcome back to my channel and for those of you who don't know i'm tina hi yeah today is i'm trying to get some suction on my teeth if you might have thought hey you sound kind of weird today <laughs> yeah trying to get the good old suction yeah i should have my cereal bar over here to stop my gagging but you know me i like to start things without being prepared so let me go grab a cereal bar real quick and I'll be right back. Yep, Josie's at school. Anthony's at work. Nibble, nibble. Trying to chew up the thing. Yeah, because of my dentures being not fitting correctly, as I've told you in the past, I have developed an ulcer in here. So it has become very painful for me to wear my dentures. I went to the doctor's yesterday. I got some mouthwash, medicated mouthwash to help with the pain. But I have a lot of videos to film for Vlogoween. Yes, today is day one of Vlogoween. And I wanted to do a short video just telling you what to expect from Vlogoween. Now, obviously, Vlogoween is um, just videos related to Halloween, but not every single video in the month of October is going to be somehow Halloween related. Tina's not that good. Though I like to try, but... Plus, I, I already have a few videos on my, my uh, computer that I had already filmed... And they have no mention of Vlogoween in them at all. And I don't want to, like, save them until November, because that would just be kind of dumb. Because they're there, you know what I'm saying? So the, I'm going to probably post, because I have the Walmart haul, the Walmart delivery haul, and I also have a Wegmans haul. And the Howler haul. The Howler haul is kind of Halloween related, because... I do have some more Halloween stuff that I ordered. But yes, uh, a lot of the videos will be Halloween related and some of the videos will not be Halloween related. And, you know, we'll do some videos just playing around where I'll put a wig on and, and um, like pretending I'm a mermaid or something and do the makeup to... Um, to make myself more mermaidy, <laughs> mermaidy is that a word? I don't think it is, but it is for today. Yes, it is a word for today. And um, you can expect a video every day for the month of October. I'm gonna do my best, anyways. And if for some reason something comes up that I can't post a video, then I'll let you guys know on my Facebook page why. I want to get more involved in on my Facebook page that I made for my channel. You know, telling you guys, you know, if I don't post a video on a certain day, the reason behind it. Or, you know, just to talk to you guys. But we do have a lot of videos I need to do. A lot of them, the Halloween related ones. Yeah, I'm not doing any kind of special makeup today. I'm just doing my normal makeup routine and going to um, film videos that I had already had planned to do. I did get upstairs and start cleaning out the storage room. And I will be taking you guys up with me on my next adventure upstairs. Because to um, begin, because there was a lot of stuff up there. I needed my son's help. And so I wasn't able to film that. But we got a lot of it done. 
So when I go back up there again, I won't need be needing as much of his help. And you guys can be there with me. And I can show you guys around upstairs. Because I've never showed you guys before. And I'm sure you guys are curious. What the upstairs looks like. And if you're wondering, I mean, I have like this whole upstairs that, you know, why I don't go up there to do my videos and stuff, like have like a, a room for my videos. It's just, I have a hard time getting up and down the stairs because I'm an overweight woman. To be perfectly honest with you, it's hard for me to get up and down the stairs. I see a bug crawling across the top of my thing. big bug too. A stink bug? Looks like a stink bug. <laughs> Give me the heebie-jeebies. The thing's huge. Is it going to make my, my kitchen stink really bad if I go kill it? I hate stink bugs. I really do. I hate them. I wish I didn't notice it. I'll just leave it be. I don't want it stinking up my kitchen. But if it comes anywhere closer near me, I will have to kill it. If it gets in my personal space, it'll have to die. Yes, it will. Ugh, they give me the heebie-jeebies. I hate bugs. I do, I do, I do. I don't think, well, I'm sure there are some, but most of the time, I'm not the only one that hates the bugs. Okay. I'm thinking I'm going to go with um, blue today. So I'm gonna, first I'm going to just put a little bit of this on. I kind of use this kind of like as a concealer, as a, a means to get the eyeshadow to stick. And I just pretty much just put it on my lid. And it's going to have to dry. And this helps um, put the shine in my eyeballs. It puts the shine in my eyeshadow. Yes, it does. Yeah, we are going to be going through all of my, my makeup that I have, like, tried. Like, on some of my videos, you know, my unboxing videos, I'll get something. I'll be like, oh, yeah, I'll try it. And then I try it that one time, and then I never use it again. Or, like, I'll have some palettes while I might have used a few colors out of it, but the rest of the colors are pretty much not even touched. And so we're going to go through, not in this video, but it'll be a video all by itself where we're going to go through all my used makeup and um, stuff that I decide I don't want is going to go in a giveaway. And, um, you know, obviously it is up to you if you want to enter the giveaway for it. If you have issues with used makeup, then, you know, don't enter the giveaway. I know I told you this in a past video, but yeah, that is something you can look forward to in the month of October. And I will be doing a lot of little DIY crafts in the month of October of making um, Halloween-related items like uh, bracelets and earrings and that kind of stuff. And all that stuff's going to go into a little giveaway that you can expect in the month of October, probably towards the end of the month. And the... Um, We'll be doing like the goodie bags for the kids, and that'll also go in the get the giveaway. You'll um, get a a winner will get one of my little goodie bags. And so, if you like candy, <laughs> I like the candy. I like the candy. Yeah, we're gonna. Um, if you noticed, I haven't been answering my comments, and I have a reason for that. Uh, I'm sure you've noticed I've been doing a video where I read and answer the comments. And I thought it would be fun to actually answer the comments 
on the um, video where I actually type in my reply. So, you know, at the same time, I'll be talking to you guys about the reply to your comments. But then I'll also, you'll be able to see me um, enter the comment as well. I thought that would be fun and cool. Yes, I did. So, um, yeah, you can expect that video as well. I got my little trusty thingy. I'm just going to use a little, 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 little bit. <laughs> a little bit of the blue here just to give it a little bit of color. On my eyeball. Or my eyelid. My eyeball is hazel. With a touch of brown in it. I don't even know what color you would classify my eyes as. Sometimes they look green. Sometimes they look blue. Sometimes they look silver. They kind of like change colors. Depending on my mood. I'm like a mood ring. My eyeballs are a mood ring. And they change with my mood. And y'all know me. I love I love to get as much shimmer and shine as I can. And so I always bring out my ColourPop Golden State of Mind shimmers. Yeah, this eventually will be going into a giveaway of used eyeshadows. Because as you can see, I've only used like two of the colors. I think I tried this one. I've only used the two, and so once those two are gone, you know, this is a, a, a good palette. <laughs> it's a perfectly good palette, you know, that somebody else might want to use, but I'm not getting rid of it until I use up the purple and the blue on it, because I do like the purple and the blue, but I don't use any of the other colors. No, I don't. I don't know. I do have tons of palettes. And I probably have these colors in other palettes. It has like, they're all shimmers. Every single one of them. And so now I got a nice, pretty, sparkly eye. Who was it that loves the glittery eye as well? La, La, La Verde? And <laughs> I'm butchering that name. Because I am not remembering it. Laverno. I think I'm totally completely wrong on that. Let's go into the comments. Just to look up her name. Lorelai. Lorelai. That is how you, what the name is. Sorry about that, Lorelai. Lorelai is one of those. Don't you like the sparkly eye too? I love it. I love me a sparkly eyeball. The more the shimmer, the better. Yeah, I hadn't heard from you in a while, Lorelei. Yeah, I know, we're all busy with life. I do read the comments, even though I, I haven't been answering them. But that was because I want to do a video of answering them with you guys. You know when you put on your eyeliner and mascara, you have to have your mouth wide open because otherwise it doesn't go on right. Not exactly sure why that is, that you have to hold your mouth wide open. I think that goes for everybody that wears makeup. You have to wear, hold your mouth wide open to put on your <laughs> eyeliner and your mascara. But now that I'm thinking about it, I'm keeping my mouth shut. Is the Wendy that says you're not finished doing your makeup until 
you have put on your eye mascara. I don't know where my perfume is, so I'm just going to wear this generic one that I got. Yeah, I have to find my perfume. It's probably in my drawer with my makeup behind me, one of those drawers. It is probably in one of those. We need to put on some lipstick. I got this lipstick from a BoxyCharm. I love the top to it. I had completely forgot about it because I had I had gone through one of my, um, the drawers behind me. I think it was where I found it, and I had gone through them and I found that lipstick. I'm like, oh yeah, I, heard, I totally forgot about you, lipstick. I totally forgot that I owned you, and so I grabbed it and I put it in my makeup bag. That is what I did. I'm working on another thing, a plastic canvas. And um, this, I'm, I just cut out some thingies. I'm doing my own design. I did do a plastic canvas cover for you, Mary. I'm not going to show it to you because it's going to be a surprise. And I'm going to also send you that keychain that you liked. I'll have to dig it out of my drawer over here. It's kind of covered with things. <laughs> Can I turn you? You see, the um, keychains are in this middle drawer here, so I had to kind of like move all this stuff to get to that middle drawer. But yeah, I was making you something, and so I was um, waiting to finish that before I sent out you your package. Plus, I was waiting for after the first of the month because <laughs> Tina was broke. And I also have an, um, one other item I wanted to send you, so... You can expect something in the mail. Do I have food on my mouth? No, and me probably, because you know me. I love wearing food on my lips. <laughs> but yeah, you can. I'll be mailing that out um, very, very soon. Like I said, I wanted to finish that item before I mailed the item out, if that makes sense. I hope it does. Sippy, sippy. But yeah, we got, um, well, I have a lot of things planned that I want to do today. We'll see what I get accomplished. Um, but yeah, I'm going to work on doing the, um, the comments today. We'll get that done. And, um, I'm hoping to get, start on doing the decorations. Like, I don't know if I've completed my thought. <laughs> I have list it. I probably do. But like I was saying, I went upstairs, went through a lot of the stuff because I was mainly looking for the um, Halloween decorations. And so I did find them. And we're going to do a, a video going through the decorations and another video of actually putting up the decorations. And so I thought that there would there be two videos, both Halloween related, that you can look forward to. And um, yeah, we're going to be working on my plastic canvas. It's going to be, it's my own design, and um, it's all candy corn <laughs> related. Yeah, Bobby had put me on the track of doing candy corn related items. I don't know why, but it's like the easiest thing to do when it comes to plastic canvas. And so we're just going to work on that a little bit and talk and stuff. But, yeah, we won't do that right now. That'll be another video where I'll show you um, exactly how to make it if you decide you want to make it. Um, also, we'll do some jewelry. I want to show you how to use the, um, I almost threw it across the room. Yeah, I had this fake, um, leather where I'm going to show you how to make a bracelet out of it, or you can make a choker out of it. Maybe we'll do both. Um, what else do we have planned? Yeah, I do have some DIY projects. I got a really deep itch in my ear. I'm gonna Trying to itch it. Ugh. I'm gonna try taking a cotton swap to it. Maybe it's a piece of earwax that's like itching me, tickling me. Whatever you want. I'll cut this part out because you don't need to see it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I had a really deep itch and I couldn't reach it. I didn't want to keep, you know, jiggling my finger in there and then, you know, giving me an earache because 
earaches suck. They hurt. I didn't want to do that. Um, but what else are we going to do? I do have another holler haul coming our way. Oh, yeah, we're going to work on the scrapbooking. I, um, when I was upstairs, I looked for the Christmas cards I got. And so we're going to put those in the scrapbook. So we'll be having a whole bunch of fun. I think I'll wait because I did get the Christmas cards for um, from Christmas last year, which I want to put in the scrapbook. But I might wait till Christmas time to do that and only work on, well, I don't know because I don't have any Halloween cards. So, you know, maybe we'll just, you know, put in like, a, I don't know, we'll have to figure it out. I do want to figure out how to get some pictures from my phone. So um, that's something I'm trying to figure out. I probably can just go to, like, to Walgreens or something and get the pictures made. I want to get the smaller pictures for my scrapbook. But, yeah, so that that's something else I want to figure out how to do. I did buy, uh, um, from Howler, I bought a, a mount for your vehicle to put your phone on. And so because I have hills all around me. The hills are alive with the sound of the music. Anyways, yeah, we have hills surrounding us with trees. And the trees, they change colors in the fall. Um, then the leaves fall off, blah, blah, blah. Obviously, because I live in New York. But yeah, I wanted to get my vehicle and get my camera on the, the dash and film when the leaves start to turn so you can see how pretty the hills look and that's something you can look forward to maybe go for a drive i'll show you around town and you know that's something i've never shown you um if the car mount works i bought it from howler so i never used a car mount before so we'll see um I'm trying to think what else i have planned to do oh yeah we'll be doing a come clean with me my house mess my kitchen's a mess we're going to be working on that today um i did went i did go to the doctors to um yesterday and um i've been having some really bad issues with my back that has that has had a lot to do with um the scarcity of my videos um i've been working towards getting an mri done which i finally had approved and so we're gonna have an mri done but, you know, my fingertips, they're starting to go numb. My toes are going numb. Um, yeah, um, I don't know if you can see it. The fingers, I have, like, bumps on my fingers and my thumb, which they're they're thinking it might be the uh, the beginnings of rheumatoid arthritis. Yeah, I am I am batting a thousand when it comes to my back. And, um... Yeah, we're just working on getting all this kind of stuff done. And I'll keep you updated in the future on what happens and what I find out. You know, all that good and fun stuff. And, of course, you know, I quit smoking. And one of the ways I have been battling cravings and, you know, is taking naps. <laughs> and um, also when I'm taking a nap, I'm not eating because the whole um, quitting smoking, you, you um, tend to eat to replace the hand-to-mouth gesture of smoking a cigarette. And so I have been pigging out and so to to um, conquer the, you know, eating everything in sight, I have been taking a nap. And so that's also impeded my ability to film and uh, post videos. Um, I'm trying to think what else I wanted to tell you guys. I'll take a sippy sippy. Mm. Oh, yeah, I wanted to tell you, when I, w I went to the doctors, is the main reason I brought it up, that I had gained 25 pounds, and I'm not going to let it get to me. I knew quitting the smoking, I was going to gain the weight, and so, you know, I just, um, I'm going to conquer the cravings for the cigarettes, and then I will conquer the eating everything <laughs> in sight. Yes, yeah, so I'm not going to let it bring me down or depress me. And um, so that's pretty much it, you know. So the my my weight loss journey and does it fit, you know, that's going to be put on the back burner for a while because I've gained weight instead of lost it. So I can guarantee you those black pants that I finally got on, they ain't going to fit no more. They are not going to fit no more. No, I gained the 25 pounds, so 
Yep, and then my next weigh in is in six months, so hopefully I will have lost some of that 25 pounds, if not all of it. So, um, yeah, we'll just have to see what happens and that kind of stuff. But yeah, so I'm going to stop this here. The video is about 26 minutes long. So um, don't forget, like, comment, share, and subscribe. Here you'll see my little picture right smack dab here in the middle. So click on it if you haven't subscribed yet. And you'll see a video here or here of um, something that I recently posted. And the other video will be something that eBay recommends. So, but until next time.